From Cass Holt to Sunset Lake, streets in Holly Springs have a wide variety of names. How are new streets named? And where do these names originate? When a new neighborhood is built in Holly Springs, a list of proposed names is sent to Wake County. This list of names goes to Wake County and the county staff either approves or disapproves of the names. No two roads in Wake County can have the same name, so emergency responders will know exactly where to go. The Town of Holly Springs Department of Planning and Zoning can also disapprove of a proposed name. For example, the town will no longer allow any new street name to include Holly, Sunset, or Springs, as many roads already include those words. Often, proposed street names incorporate a theme within the neighborhood. For example, Windward Point has a tropical theme. The parks at Bass Lake streets are named after national and state parks. And Holly Point has Harry Potter themed names, Expecto Patronum. Some roads in Holly Springs are named after two points that connect, such as Old Holly Springs Apex and Piney Grove Wilbon. Other street names originate from the town's history. For example, Castle Road, Ralph Stevens Road, and Earp Street are named after the original families who owned and lived on the nearby land. The Avent brothers owned a ferry on the Cape Fear River. It is thought that at one point in time, the section of Avent Ferry Road in Holly Springs was connected to Avent Ferry Road in Raleigh. The NC-55 bypass traveling through Holly Springs is named after George Benton Alford, the second owner of the Mims House and the founder of Holly Springs. Center Street in downtown Holly Springs was once the geographical center of Holly Springs. With a town that offers such a rich history and variety of ways to enjoy life, is it any wonder our street names also reflect our community's character?